Hi guys, this is Corno from Zone Off-Road. Thought we we're going to show you a video today of uh, what we've built in the last couple of days. We're very proud to be been involved in this vehicle. And this is as well to show you guys that we not only do Jeeps, we build a lot of other vehicles. Let me take you around the vehicle and tell you what we've done to it. Firstly, we've dressed this vehicle with the Onka bumpers. Onka is one of our premium partners. We've added LED lights. Don't know if you can see that one. From JW Speaker. We fitted the set of Hella um, head uh, spotlights. We've added Cooper and a set of uh, Dirty Love mags. Now, one of the key things that we've done here, we've fitted with a set of Fox 2.5 DSCs. There you can see the adjuster, very accessible from the front, high speed and low speed. Now, this vehicle has only got a two and a half or two inch lift on it, two to three inch. What's very important with these vehicles when you do Put a suspension in them one of the key things that you need to have a look at is this little wire here. that is your speed sensor and it works your abs now you need the right bracketry like this to move it down because the vehicle is going up so you need to make sure that that's in secondly we move the sway bar down so if the front shocks or the front wheel goes down and you get get a lot of travel you uh, um, it doesn't catch the sway bar now you've seen this vehicle it's got 35 inch coopers on one of the main problems that you do have when you fit 35 inch wheels on this is it rubs on the rear now how do we get get that sorted with this little ingenious little unit this is a caster correction so there you can see we move the center bolt quite forward quite a bit now that gives us the clearance from the firewall to the wheel to enable us to run 35s and that also corrects the geometry in the front where you pick up the vehicle and the caster is incorrect putting that in sorts out the caster going to the rear there you can see the adjustment high speed low speed that we uh, the canister that you can do the, the adjustment very easy to get your hand in there we've opted for Dobbins and coils and leaf pack at the rear we found those units work very well together now one of the the main things here is the roof rack this is an Onka roof rack newly designed and developed by them now one of the main things that you know on this roof rack or on any roof rack is wind noise There's none whatsoever. When I drove this vehicle around about 150, 160 k's an hour, we do not have any wind noise on this. We also fitted a three roll bar, bull bar, roll bar at the back. Um, comes now with a new nice um, we can hold on. We found uh, the clients ask for that and last but least we fitted with a rear tow bar very nicely done another on cup product we fitted the the on -car rock sliders and to finish off the product 
we opted, or the client opted for a power package from Safari. We'll do the figures a little bit later. We did the pre dyno we'll do the post dyno um, This is a massive snorkel that gives you a lot of airflow into the vehicle. Have you ever tried breathing through a straw? Well, you won't be able to need to do that with this little unit, yeah. When you look inside the motor, the only thing you'll see, this little unit, yeah. So what this does is it comes with a wiring loom. It plugs into the standard ECU, all the plugs being supplied, it's a plug and play system. You plug it in. And this unit is pre-configured with a VIN number and all your aftermarket accessories that your vehicle has, like the exhaust system, like the snorkel, the heavy duty clutch that we fitted to this. It's, it's a matter of getting in the vehicle once all is fitted and driving off and having the power for your utilization. Inside the vehicle, went with this in indole fridge we found these units actually work very nice we also fitted an onca uh, tray that this fits onto now when you look in the back you'll notice there's a little safe under that which is very nice to store some valuable zone and last but least we fitted an onca roof console that's for all your all, all your goodies and your uh, two-way radio and and so on guys now that you that you've seen this video you can see that uh, zone off-road is not only doing jeeps we actually built an awesome cruiser um, i really think the client's gonna like this and uh, we're handling handing this over today uh, we still need to do some a sound system on this unfortunately the client got the vehicle a little bit late and uh, we'll be installing that in about a week's time or two weeks time when he comes back from holiday and uh, and we'll bring you this weekly update on what we're doing in zone and uh, we'll take it from there